It doesn't get any more tension packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup final. Who is going to come out on top? Stay with us for all the action coming up next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Croatia against Morocco. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. And the starting 11 for Croatia. Luka Modric plays alongside Marcelo Brozovic in the centre of midfield. And up front, it's the Croatian international Andrej Kramaric. And here's how Morocco will line up. Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper. Hakim Ziyech plays with Sofiane Bouffal in the wide positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And so the battle commences. An attacker like that in the initial phase of the game, attracting the interest of the referee. So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there, he's not going to take any messing about here. Able to deal with the threat. Ziyech. Return to Hakimi. Determined defending. And a throw in it's going to be. Sofian Amrabat. Good movement. Well, the goalkeeper dealt with it admirably. Gvardiol. And Kramaric on the ball. Ivan Perisic. Kramaric must be the opening goal in the final and how important could that be as a direction pointer well as you can see he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace and then it's a decent finish that's a very good goal you have to say And 
back underway. 1 0 it is. Unahi. And Nesiri. Bufal. Who can he pick out? This could square the game. Oh, but no! Heroism flashed in front of his eyes. Couldn't take the chance. Well, I think that's a poor miss. They really should be level now. Will they come to regret that? Mateo Kovacic. Look at Modric with the pass. Well, nothing productive, really. Can they hit on the break? Defenders need to cover. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Oh, the equaliser. Just what they needed. And the dream remains very much alive. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Amala. Well, wasted opportunity here. Would have been a decent chance, but offside the verdict. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Promising sequence. Magnificent defending. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? All hands on deck. And now passing it through. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Andrei Kramaric. Modric unable to hang on to the ball. Kramaric. Could cross it in here. Oh dear, not really troubling the goalkeeper at all, Stuart. Well, from that range, he should be scoring, and he knows it. Well, there you have it. They haven't been good enough going forward. They've created very little so far. They need to play with much more urgency. And they still don't have the ball. That has been a recurring theme. What can they do from here? A well, fine reading of the situation. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Kramaric. Here's Modric. That is that for the first half here. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Buffal. 
Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. They could nudge in front. Really classy goalkeeping. Offside, not that anyone knew. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. And Nesiri. Ziyech, chance to finish. Really important tackle. And he read it well. Mario Pasalic. Well, the flag has gone up. It was really close. Mario Pasalic. Thirty minutes left for play. Ziyech. Can he put them in front? And there it is! They take command in the final. And just look at the celebrations here. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Goal! So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Andrei Kramaric. Now can they make something happen? Perisic being egged on by the crowd. Terrific block. Unahi. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. And support available. And he's clear his lines. Sofian Amrabat. Couldn't hang on to the ball. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Bonna Sosa. Ten minutes left for play. They're showing a willingness to attack, as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. And the referee has caught up with him following his indiscretion earlier. And the substitution will occur now. Going short. And the cross into the middle. Well, when it left the boot, I thought it might have a chance of fooling the keeper, but it didn't. A 
and it was in the right place to intercept. Yusuf and Nesiri. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, do they have it in them to level this? And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. And they will make the change now. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Good pressure, can they make... Oh, could be a chance! Oh, a goal to level us up in the closing stages! Who's going to claim the trophy? It's an open question here. Well, as you can see again, Modric plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes. But this is not over, and two 15-minute periods of extra time to come. So, back in business here, the first period of extra time, and it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Could be a chance to break here. And Perisic prepared to fire. Not the best clearance. Oh, goal! He's going to be rightly proud of that moment. Sensational! Well, we won't get tired of seeing this, will we? The athleticism, the connection, the accuracy, that's a great goal. say defences are on top 3-2 well read to ease the pressure and a goal kick will be next That's a well-timed pass. The end product just wasn't there. Kramaric. And back with Kovacic. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Brozovic. Will he play it in? The clearance wasn't decisive. That's it, half-time in extra time. The second period still to come.
Well, underway again, the second period of extra time. Who's going to prevail here? Kramaric. His fate lies with the referee who booked him earlier. And it will be his last act of the day. He's off. Well, what was he thinking? It's a silly tackle, isn't it? And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Roman Saiz. Azadin Unahi. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Andrei Kramaric. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. And he's through here. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, no end product. Played into the centre. Well, no problems defensively. And the referee blows the whistle for full time. We have new World Cup winners, namely Croatia. Well, four years ago, they got to the final and were frustrated. This time, they've gone one better. And what a great performance from them. World Champions! The beaten finalists in 2018 are the winners in 2022. And what a night it is, especially for their fans. They've followed their team here. The players have played brilliantly. The coach has done a great job as well. What a night for everybody involved with Croatia.